I'm not sure if you can see it, but there is a white house. That white house is Finca Flores Amarillas, and Steve has been doing a little bit of work for them. So I'm going up to check out what he's doing. Hola amigos! <laughs> Soy Janie, yes to es fincate. No, es to es finca flores amarillas. <laughs> is doing some work for a neighbor uh, to build a play park. It's a heck of a play park, uh, but that's because it's a guest house. Game. Yeah, it's a little like Ludo. Uh, it's a bit weird. No, it's like Ludo. That is the front of the pirate ship. And round here, there will be the back end, which isn't quite there yet. Not exactly what you'd call a kit. Excited. Mine host, <laughs> mine host, Paul. Oh, well, I try. Yes, I'll put the kettle on in a minute. Oh, brilliant. It's <laughs> angles as well, and you haven't got enough wood either side to use the. Yeah, that's true. Uh, and the tolerances are small because it's angled. Take a bit more off. More complicated instructions for the back. Right there is our house. Okay, let me see about that thing. Roll on summer. Outdoor kitchen. Barbecue. It's a very Spanish thing to uh, get together as a family and rent out a holiday home. When you have a large family and lots of people get together, hiring somewhere like this for a holiday becomes much more affordable. Plus, you're bringing your own company with you. Of course, <laughs> You may want to get away from your family when you go on holiday, but like so for us, that kind of thing would be a super idea because um, we don't get to see our family very often. I have lovely great big windows. Oh, yeah, I'm very keen. Um, you won't be able cleaning. to see. Um, I'm sure you won't be able to see. We've got see. guests coming this weekend. Right, for the so, whole house. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so I've got to. One of my jobs today is to clean the kitchen, make it spotless. So I'll be working on the surfaces and the windows and things. Yeah. And uh, we move out on Friday. Summer was great, obviously, because we had a yeah. swimming pool, so we get a lot of business in the summer, but all through the autumn it's been amazing. 
You could do that anywhere in the world. Oh, we didn't come to Spain to run a guest house. Paul came to Spain because he had been in Japan for two years at a time or longer. Yeah, yeah, years. yeah. So he was looking for a new place to go ah. and teach English. And I came to Spain because uh, I was studying Spanish at a university and I did an exchange program and that brought oh, me to Madrid and then I just stayed on and then okay. a few years later we met and uh, we decided to uh, leave Madrid and come to Extremadura and uh, start a B&B here. Well, lately it's been mostly Spanish uh, national mm -hmm. guests. Uh, we haven't had uh, a foreign uh, guest since before the COVID, uh, the pandemic. Mm -hmm. uh, and then, uh, you know, they, they tell other people and then they get in touch. So uh, now uh, it's kind of, a, I won't say a well-oiled machine, but kind of, yeah. um, we, we are not beginners uh, uh, struggling. Anyway. Yeah. Today is Wednesday, it's a work day, and it's silent here, so quiet. Well, we're so fortunate. 